Alright, and I'm back. Hey guys, welcome back to the game we're playing. I'm Dave the Usher. The game we're playing is Streets of Rage for the Sega Game Gear. And this game is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. How y'all doing? Whew! Getting frustrated! Arr, come on, Blaze Fielding, we gotta do this. Arr. There you go. There you go. Get the pipe. Get the pipe. Come on. Step right up, assholes. It's a two-for-one special. Oh, you bastard. Five dollar lead pipe. Yeah, eat it fresh. Okay. I'm in the mood for a subway all of a sudden. Damn it, come on. Game Gear controls. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's been criticized by many reviews that the controls aren't the best in this game. Damn it! Uh, a game with bad controls, I'm not gonna say it's bad. I'm gonna say it's below average. Uh, anyway. <sighs> there you go. Fuck off. Fuck off. Batter up, bitch. I'm not gonna say it's bad, but <laughs> it's, uh... And especially, like, uh, if there's a great game you've played, like Streets of Rage on the Sega Genesis, and it has good controls, and then you play pretty much the same game on another, you know, platform, or whatever, uh, and then the controls aren't as good, it's just like, wait, this is wrong, I've played this before, it's so good, it's so good, the controls are great! Oh, it's it's really not the same. No, but it is the same. Oh, it's just a big mind fuck, and it just really it even drives you even more nuts than playing, you know, let's say a game with bad controls. Playing a game you've played before with good controls that now has bad controls. You following me here? Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh, oh. Yeah, you can do that too. You can do that too. I was unaware. Had I known that, I probably would have reacted a little. Damn it! Okay, <laughs> okay, okay. It's it's getting a little messy. It's getting a little messy here. This is stage two. You know, maybe I'm glad there's only five stages. Did I just drop off? I did. Okay, that's bad. Don't do that. Don't do that. See, I'll demonstrate it again because I really don't mind to. But still, uh, if you're playing this game, you might not want to do that. Okay, let's, let's, uh, let's get, <laughs> okay, I can't get up, I can't get up, I'm off the screen, I don't know what's going on, okay, things are starting to get a little puzzling and confusing, I am a little puzzled and confused, and so far I hate the, uh, the guy in the red short, uh, shirt, and the brown pants who does those kicks, I hate him the most so far in this game. I'm probably going to be able to top that with someone else who pisses me off even more. We're going to all have to wait and see because it's going to get crazy. Hey, look, a parking cone. Yeah, get over there. Oh, it's this guy. Okay, we uh, we have a tie. We have a tie, everybody. Okay, we, we have a big tie. Could have used that a little bit ago. Thanks. Damn it. Ugh. No, I'm just trying the punch. All I'm doing is trying the punch right now, okay? You're not letting me. You're not letting me. Now I can't move. And now every time I get up, I get hit right away. And now every time I get hit, <laughs> I die. Okay, let's let's try and get out of here. You gotta use the jump. This is not your regular, typical Streets of Rage Sega Genesis games, folks. You gotta you gotta understand that when going into this. Ugh. Okay, we're gonna continue. Okay, that was useful. S. S for Streets of Rage, I guess. Okay, just punch him. Just punch him. Thank you. There you go. That worked. That worked. Whew. Doggy boys. Ah oh, man! Oh. All right, let's talk a little more about the Sega Game Gear. Okay, yeah, g give me the guy with the yellow hair who should have red hair. Give me the guy with the yellow hair who should have red hair. I like this guy. He's just a stupid dork. Just comes walking around. I can take care of this guy. Okay, I just want to punch him. No, no, just want to punch him. Thank you, thank you, Game Gear. But anyway, let's talk a little bit about the Game Gear. Oh no, this is gonna be extremely annoying. <laughs> let's talk about how this is gonna be extremely annoying, actually. What the hell? 
That's the big guy who blows the fire breath. It looks like it's always out of his mouth, though. Oh, yeah, I can't pick this guy up. Well, yeah. <laughs> okay, now we, we've run into a big, interesting problem. I'm not trying to pick him up. Just want to get close and punch him. Let's try jump kicks. Good mother Jesus. So they made this guy a boss? Oh, good guy. I gotta wait. There we go. There we go. That's good. Up. Okay, charge at me. Come on. Now wait. Oh, whoa, he came out you fast there. There we go. Okay, picking up the strategy. Better safe than sorry, right? There you go. There you go. Oh, he's getting closer to me. Bye bye baby. Whew. Round two clear. Give me an extra life. Nah. Round three start. So anyway, I was going to talk a little about the Game Gear. Okay. When does the Game Gear appeal to us most, you know? This game, the Game Gear, came out, you know, early 90s. But why would we play it? When is the best time and opportunity to play a Sega Game Gear? I'll tell you. Car trips, road trips, you little kid, man. Parents going, uh, we're going somewhere, I don't know, vacation, business, who, who the hell knows, something. We're driving to another state, to another destination, far away, covering many miles. Gonna take a day or two, maybe, even. Uh, what do you bring, man? You bring the fucking Game Gear. Well, I could tell you a lot of stories about uh, car trips and road trips in my life. But, uh, you know, from the age of, you know, five or, you know, remembrance up until uh, yesterday. Yesterday, I went to my friend's house yesterday. It was like a road trip, you know, a road trip. I took a trip, you know, a road trip to find road trip. Anyway, we're getting sidetracked. So, uh, you know, what do you bring? You bring the game gear. You bring the game gear on your road trip. You're in the back seat. Uh, lucky for me, I'm an only child. I uh, got the whole back seat to myself. It's like a little room. It's like a miniature room for myself with all my toys and goodies and all the stuff. And your game gear. You bring your game gear, man. And what, what games do you play? You play games like this. Sonic was ported to the Game Gear, of course. Streets of Rage, the, one of my favorite, actually my most favorite uh, Game Gear game, Defenders of Oasis. Always loved playing that on the Game Gear. Oh, God, I only wish that Toe Jam & Earl was uh, ported to the Game Gear. Now that would have been a good trip. Throw him! Getting aggravated. 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 Okay, is that enough? <laughs> whoa, 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 he's disappearing. What the fuck? He's a ghost. Okay, uh, something, something is uh, happening right now. It's starting to freak me out. I don't know what's going on. I think they're ghosts. I'm on a ship. What the fuck? Okay, uh, that was a good attack, buddy. It's like ninja smoke skills there. Okay, am I alone? I don't know. Can I pick this up? How about I pick this up? Can I pick this up? Thank you. Hi, I'm Game Gear. Maybe they're blinking because of the boats moving and it's too uh, its too much for uh, the Game Gear to handle or something. Is this the Nintendo? What's going on here? They're supposed to blink there. That makes sense. Can I break this? No, I can't. Where's this boat going anyway, man? These shoes are killing me, man. The last time I wear high heels when I kill people on the streets of rage. Even though I'm on a boat now, not the streets. Okay. 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 Special. Wow, a perfect position to get killed right there. I was right in the dead center of those two. You don't have to be uh, totally lined up when you do that kick. Just be in the general area and you're going to hit him. It's okay, Game Gear. You tried. I'm not going to... I'm not going to say this is a horrible game. Of course not. I'm not going to badmouth you. We should be lucky to have uh, Streets of Rage going on road trips in the car as a kid. And I can still play this game. It's great. Uh, 
Arr! Cat fight. There you go. Merry Christmas. Feliz Navidad. Happy Hanukkah. Hua. Okay. There we go. Arr! Okay. Oh, the throwing. The throwing. Yeah, if you do your attack enough, she'll do that little jump thing at the end. It's like almost for show. God damn it. No, come on, man. Okay, that's it. Jump. Jump kick. Kill. Anyway, guys, it looks like I'm about out of time. I want to thank you all for watching. Fuck you. I'm Dave the Usher for the Gamer Play. Stay tuned for the next part of Streets of Rage. I'll see you guys next time. I am out.